I love autumn. I love this time of year and today's video I wanted to basically sit down and rabbit on about the reasons why I love autumn. This time of year is my favourite time of the year. Um, winter comes a very close second and I'm going to tell you the reasons why. Number one, it is acceptable to hibernate. It's acceptable basically to do absolutely nothing. To get in your pyjamas, put the fire on, light a candle, that's it, do nothing. I love that. It's not really acceptable in the, in the summer, but I don't care because I hibernate all the time. But I love it. Number two, the clothes in the shops. Burgundies come out, purples come out, dark reds come out. I love them type of colours. Cozy jumpers come out. Boot, you can get your boots out. Leggings, cozy jumpers, boots. What a combination. Absolutely love it. Number three, pumpkin spice lassies come out in Starbucks. Pumpkin spice lassies. Absolutely love them. I've had about three already. I know that's not much compared to what probably loads of other people have. But pumpkin spice lassies, oh, are just the, the best thing ever. If you haven't tried them, guys, you need to go to Starbucks. There's a reason why they've sold about 200 million in the last so many years of them because they're fabulous. Halloween. Halloween. I love Halloween. I've started decorating, as you can see. Um, not that much. I need to get more stuff. I mean, you know, there's really only, you know, the middle to end of September. Um, but I've started decorating. I love Halloween. I love dressing up. I love um, trick or treating. I just love the whole, the whole thing. It just makes me really, really smile. I just wish... That sometimes lived in America, so you could do it on a huge scale because they do. Um, the smells of autumn, autumn candles, um, cinnamon candles. I have this pumpkin spice candle here that I got from my coma bargain. It only cost me about three pounds. It has a good smell. Doesn't really um, give off much of a scent when you burn it. But hey ho, that's what you get for paying three pounds for the candle, doesn't it? Um, what else? That crispness of autumn, that whole watching the leaves turn brown and orange and red, them awesome colours. Oh, they just make, make, it just makes me so happy. Then we go on to Bonfire Nice. And I love the smell of Bonfire Night. I love um, using. Um, going to a bonfire, a firework party, watching fireworks, I love the smell of them, I love the smell of them the next morning, I love sparklers, although sparklers still scare me, fireworks still scare me because I remember when I was little and even now it's like, it passed me quite petrified with sparklers because if, you, if you're like my age, around about 38, then you'll remember the adverts we used to get on the telly around about um, bonfire night. And they did an off shit me up talking about, you know, never go back to a lit a, a firework. Never go back to an unlit firework. Never pick a, pick a sparkle back up. And I had this in my head and I remember last year Olivia having one and dropping it and going to pick it up and I nearly had a heart attack. Because yeah, if you want if you might around my age you'll understand totally what I mean. And then after Halloween and after Bonfire Nights, we get on to Christmas and oh my god I'm a big kid when it comes to Christmas I love Christmas I love everything about it I love the lights I love the decorations we we in our house we decorate towards the end of November we put the tree up towards the end of November um I love buying presents I love going late night shopping um I love the fact that Starbucks bring the red cups out I mean that just gets me really really excited the fact that Starbucks bring the red cups out and they bring out the gingerbread lassies, which is just, oh, even better than pumpkin lassies, and I, I love them. I love um, the fact that I have a niece and nephew, and I love watching their little faces when they open the presents. I get more joy now over going to see them Christmas Day and spending the Christmas Day with them and having a dinner at my sister's and watching them open the present and how excited they are. And it's just made it a lot more special. 
as I've got, got, got older because it, I'm not really bothered about what I get anymore for Christmas because for me my joy is see, seeing them and a lot of things I can purchase myself because I work and if you watched any of my whole videos then you'll know that yeah I do tend to treat myself a lot um one of my favourite things for a man's by Christmas is we go to a grotto in Liverpool. Uh, my, me and my sister, my mum and the two brothers, Olivia and Charlie. And we've done this for two years now, this will be the third year. And we go and see Santa. Well, brothers see Santa. I'm just in the room at the same time. Not that I don't get excited because it's Santa. Um we do that and we put our Christmas jumpers on. It's, that's like a tradition because you have to, don't you? It's got our Primark. So we've all got our Christmas jumpers on and we go and see Santa and we go for something to eat. And then we go to Liverpool while well, we really have all different things on. And we get our pitch table in the snow globe every year. And it's just one of them f family moments, family days that we share that I absolutely love. And it just makes me really, really happy. Um, so that for me is basically the reason why I love this time of year and the reasons why it makes me happy and I have all this to look forward to because then you've got January, let's not even go there because January is the most depressing friggin month of the year isn't it because you've never got any, any money and who likes January? Who likes January? I suppose a few birthdays in January then you'd like it, but um, no one's ever got any money to do anything, have they? So, yeah. So, yeah, so that was me totally rabbiting on about awesome guys and the reasons why that I love it because I just wanted to do this video. So, as usual, I shall love you and leave you and I shall see you all soon. Bye!